That is one good looking cake. Let's decorate it some more. Yum! Pink frosting! This cake looks really delicious! Let's make another mini cake. Wow, this cake looks really good too! We'll make one more mini cake. This cake looks wonderful! Let's decorate it! Mmm, that green frosting looks really good! These mini cakes are really cool! Our cake mountain also has a lot of decorations that we can create. Let's make some! Now let's add the candles. Our cake mountain is really pretty.
now let's make a multi-layer mini cake. This cake is beautiful! The roller makes cool designs! Let's make a lollipop! The candlestick can also be a lollipop stick! Here's a sweet, colorful lollipop. We hope you enjoyed this video. Please subscribe to watch more awesome Disney toys. Thanks! Hey everyone, Awesome Disney Toys here, and we're bringing you the Play-Doh Candy Cyclone playset. Today we'll be making some sweet candy balls and delicious lollipops. That was the front of the box, and this is the back of the box. Let's begin by opening up the box. We have one part of the set. Here's the other part. This is the base of the set. Here's the instruction manual. Some tools. Some more tools. and the Play-Doh that we'll be using today. And this is the final piece to the base. Now that our base is assembled, let's open up a few more packages before we start. Here's the red Play-Doh. The yellow Play-Doh. the white play-doh and the blue play-doh here's a tool that we'll be using to make our lollipop these are the lollipop sticks These are different designs for the lollipop sticks. A plate with designs on it. Here's another plate with designs on it. And we have a knife. Now it's time to make some sweet candy. We'll begin by mixing the white and blue Play-Doh together. (laughs) 
In order to make a swirl in your candy ball, make sure that you use two different types of Play-Doh. Mold it like this. Once you place the Play-Doh in the extractor, squeeze down and watch what happens. Whoa, that's cool! Awesome! We made a golden turtle! This playset provides you with many tools so that you can create as many animals as you like. We hope you enjoyed this video. Please subscribe to watch more. Thanks! Hey everyone! Awesome Disney Toys here, and we're bringing you the Play-Doh Sweet Bacon Creations. Today we're going to make some delicious sweet treats. Yum! So that was the front of the box, and this is the back of the box. Let's see what's inside the box. Here are the four Play-Dohs that we'll be using today. This is the cookie mold. Here's our oven that we'll be using. Another cookie mold. Here's a spatula. A plate to put our cookies. We can make a candle. Here are the cupcake wrappers. A roller. And this is to make the frosting for the cupcake. We also have more cookie molds. And a knife. Now that we have everything in place, let's take out the Play-Doh and start baking. So first, we're going to unwrap the Play-Doh. We have a pink Play-Doh. A baby blue Play-Doh. white play-doh for frosting and brown play-doh we're going to use the purple cookie mold and make baby blue cookies Once you mold your Play-Doh, place it onto the cookie mold. Once you have that set, place it in the oven and press down. Lift the top up and our cookie is complete. Use the knife to take off any excess Play-Doh. Let's place the cookie on the plate so we can let it cool. Now we're going to complete the cookie by making decorations. One of the cupcake wrappers on the bottom has decorations for us to use. So we'll use the white Play-Doh. Mold it like this. 
and use the roller to flatten it out. Now we have some nice decorations. Place it on top of the cookie. We have a baby blue white chocolate chip cookie. Now let's make a cupcake. We'll use the brown play-doh to make a cake batter. Once you mold it like this, place it inside the cupcake wrapper. Let's use this tool to make frosting. We're going to go with pink frosting. Once you place your Play-Doh inside the tool, use the other part of the tool to press down. Now we have ourselves a pink frosted cupcake. Let's place it on top of the oven to let it cool. Now let's add some blueberry chips. Our cupcake is complete. Now if it's someone's birthday that you're baking for, we can make a candle for them. We'll use the white play-doh to make a candlestick. Press down. and we have ourselves a nice white candle. This is the end of the video. Look at all the sweet treats that we made. They all look so good. You can place all your treats onto this plate and serve it to your friends. We hope you enjoyed this video. The Sweet Baking Creations allows you to make so many different sweet treats to enjoy with you and your friends. Please subscribe to watch more videos. Thanks! Hey everyone! Awesome Disney Toys here, and today we're bringing you Play-Doh Cake Mountain Playset. Here's the front of the box, and here's the back of the box. Let's begin by opening up the box. Here are the cake molds, extruder, and other accessories that we'll be using for the playset. Here's the top layer of the cake. This is the bottom layer of the cake. Here's the base for our cake mountain. And this is the middle layer of the cake.
This is the instruction manual. And here are the five Play-Doh that they provide for us. Let's start by opening up our Play-Doh. We get a hot pink Play-Doh Plus. We get a regular blue Play-Doh. A regular purple Play-Doh. A regular yellow Play-Doh. And a lime green Play-Doh Plus. Here's the top layer of the cake. We could make mini cakes with this. And here are the candles. Now we'll assemble our cake mountain. Cool. Let's make some mini cakes. Once you have it molded, place it on top of the set. Keep one hand on the top and twist with your other hand. As you can see, the Play-Doh will slowly go down and your candy balls will start to form. Mm, doesn't that look good? We can also make decorations on the candy balls by placing it on the set, like this. Now we have a square candy. Let's make a lollipop. You can place your candy balls inside the tool and squeeze down. Once you squeeze all the Play-Doh out, get your lollipop stick and twirl it around, like this. This is the perfect treat if you have a sweet tooth. There's our lollipop. Mm. Let's use this red and yellow Play-Doh to make some more candy balls. Make sure that you don't get too much Play-Doh in your hands or else the machine won't work. Just like before, mold the two Play-Dohs together. Now you have delicious looking candy balls. We'll call these pink lemonade. Now it's time to make our other lollipop. Squeeze down with the tool.
and grab your lollipop stick. And twirl it around just like before. Doesn't that look good? That was the Play-Doh Candy Cyclone playset. We hope you enjoyed this video. Now it's time for you to go out and make some sweet candy. Please subscribe to watch more videos. Thanks! Hey everyone! Awesome Disney Toys here! And today we're bringing you the Play-Doh Sweet Shop Double Desserts playset. Here's the front of the box. And here's the back of the box. Let's begin by opening up the box. This is the top of the oven. Here's our instruction manual. And here's the bottom part of the oven. This is the base of our playset. And here are all our other tools. And here are the four Play-Doh that they provide for us. Let's start off by opening up all the bags. Here's our scooper. Here's one of our oven molds. This is our frosting maker. Here's another oven mold. Cool, another oven mold. And this is our last oven mold. We get two plates. And one spatula. Now let's open up our Play-Doh. We get one pink Play-Doh Plus. We get a yellow Play-Doh Plus. A green Play-Doh. And a blue Play-Doh. Before we start making some delicious desserts, let's set up our playset. Cool! That's the sound it makes when our baked goods are ready. We're almost ready to bake. Let's add our green Play-Doh into the base of the playset. We'll also add the blue Play-Doh as well. Now let's grab a scoop of our green Play-Doh and place it in our oven mold. We'll add one more scoop. Place it in the oven and watch what happens. Cool, that was fast. Turn it around to see what kind of cake we got. Yum! 
That looks good. We'll leave it on our plate for now. Now let's grab a scoop of our blue Play-Doh and place it in another oven mold. We'll throw in another scoop for this too. It's time to put it in the oven. Don't you love that sound? Oh, I can't wait to see what cake we have now. That's one delicious looking cake. Now let's mix our green and blue Play-Doh to make a cake. Mmm, that already looks good. That's a yummy looking cake. Now let's use this pink Play-Doh to make some frosting. Awesome! Here's Anakin Skywalker with the blue lightsaber. Now let's make another Anakin Skywalker. This time, we'll give him a red lightsaber. Whoa, doesn't he look cool? Let's see who's stronger. Oh, they're the same. Now it's time to build our droids. Let's use some more of this red Play-Doh. Whoa, don't these droids look scary? You can place your droids and Anakin on the playmat and help fight. Use the green lightsaber to stomp on the droid. Use the blue lightsaber to slice them in half.
Well, we hope you enjoyed this video. Please subscribe to watch more. Thanks! Hey everyone! Awesome Disney Toys here. Today we're bringing you the Play-Doh Super Rainbow Value Pack. Here's the front of the box. And here's the back of the box. Let's begin by opening up the box. Here we have some rare Play-Doh, a silver Play-Doh, and a gold Play-Doh. Neat! And here are the rest of the Play-Doh colors. Here are the tools that we'll be using today. Here's a porcupine mold, some scissors, a roller, a giraffe, an elephant, and a butterfly. We also get an extractor, a crocodile, a bunny and an alligator stamp. We also get a frog and a monkey stamp. A caterpillar mold. Some tools to add on to the roller. We also get a dolphin and a horse. tools for the extractor, and a bunny and a duck. And we also get a play mat that has a bunch of Play-Doh art pictures. Cool! Let's begin by making a rabbit. We'll use the green Play-Doh. Make sure to roll it out so that you can stamp it easier. Now we have a perfect bunny. Let's use the orange Play-Doh to make some ears. And we'll add a little bit of black Play-Doh to make the eyes. Isn't this bunny cute? Now let's make our porcupine. We'll use our rare Play-Doh, the silver Play-Doh, to make our porcupine. Be sure to squeeze all the way. 
Look at his spikes grow. Cool. If you think his hair is too long, we can use the scissors to cut them off. Snip, snip, snip. Now let's use the roller and attach the tools to create some cool designs. Let's use our blue Play-Doh. Just roll it like this. Awesome! We can make two different types of roads. Now let's use our extractor. Be sure to attach the tool onto the tip of the extractor. We'll use our other rare Play-Doh, the gold Play-Doh, to put into the extractor. <laughs> 